Hi everyone, welcome back. Welcome to a new video. I'm so sorry that for the delay that I didn't upload any video in the past few weeks because uh, I have a very, very busy schedule. Anyways, uh, let's start. Today, uh, we will learn some of the polite phrases or uh, the phrases that Syrian use when they want to uh, ask for something or ask someone to do to do uh, to do, the, do them a favor uh, or when they want to request anything from anyone. Let's start with the first one. The first phrase says من فضلك من فضلك means can you do me a favor but sometimes when when we put it inside a sentence it means please or can you do me this stuff uh, let's put, put it in a sentence من فضلك عطيني القميص الأزرق من فضلك عطيني القميص الأزرق it means Please, can you give me the blue shirt? من فضلك عطيني القميص الأزرق. Please, can you give me the blue shirt? Let's move to the second phrase. It says, لو سمحت. لو سمحت لو سمحت means please لو سمحت let's put it in a sentence لو سمحت افتح باب الخزانة لو سمحت افتح باب الخزانة please can you open the closet door لو سمحت افتح باب الخزانة uh, and of course, if you want to use any of these phrases addressing a female, we will just add e. لو سمحتي إذا بتريدي من فضلك doesn't change. We just leave it من فضلك for both uh, male or female. The only thing change is what comes after that. Uh, if we are uh, using a verb that uh, we have to use the feminine form. Uh, we will change it uh, according to our sentence. Moving to the uh, next phrase. إذا بتريد إذا بتريد means if you want, but if we will use it inside a sentence, it means a please. Please can you. إذا بتريد جيب معك خبز إذا بتريد جيب معك خبز Please bring with you bread إذا بتريد جيب معك خبز إذا بتريد uh, is also uh, used in many sentences other than this but I'm just giving you uh, an example uh, of ways uh, or how to use it or put it in a sentence or if you learn it uh, uh, you can choose any form or any phrase of this uh, to request anything. So simple and easy and uh, it's one of the simplest and easiest ways to learn words. It's just one word you can say mumkin. Mumkin. So if you just forget all about all the phrases and you just memorize this word, it's enough to put it ahead of any sentence you want to request anything. You can just say mumkin. It means can you. You can we can use it by saying mumkin sabili shai or mumkin sabili shai. Can you please pour me some tea? Mumkin. And as I said, mumkin is very easy and simple and you, uh, you can recall it at any time. If you want to request anything, you can just uh, insert it ahead of your sentence. Mumkin. The last word 
word or the last phrase is Allah يخليك or Allah يخليكي. It means God bless you. Uh, and Syrians use it a lot. And if you had a chance to, to hear it, Allah يخليك or Allah يخليكي. It means please or just praying uh, or wishing you. Uh, uh, let's put it in a sentence. Uh, Allah يخليكي صيني كاسة مي. Allah يخليكي صيني كاسة مي. Please, can you bring me some water or can you give me, offer me some water? Sini kaset moi. Kaset cup. Kaset moi. A cup of water. Please, can you give me a cup of water? Allah yikhaliki sini kaset moi. This is the end of uh, my video today. I hope you learned some few phrases or uh, polite phrases uh, you can use if you want to request anything let's review them من فضلك إذا سمحت إذا بتريد الله يخليك or الله يخليكي the last word ممكن I hope you enjoyed my video today uh, please leave me comments uh, about if you know other words or other phrases that you learned or if you want to ask anything about uh, my video today please leave it uh, in the chat box below thank you so much for watching and see you the next time goodbye